Try to get them, boy. Ooh, big fool, you know. Nice one. Hybrid. To the hybrids, they don't fight as good as the bigger, like the true blue eels. Using copy jigs. All right. A little smaller one, but still a nice blue eel. Not a bad one. Marking them. Dropping this on top of their heads. I was going to use a bobber, but eh. Get them back in. This one's probably going to be a true blue eel. Yep. Oh, a big hybrid. Oh, yeah. That's a nice one. Oh, yeah. You can tell by the splashing. Yeah, look at that guy. It's a nice one there. Back in, marking them, marking and dropping right on top of their heads. They don't really care about the warm, so I'm just using this thing. A little crappie jig. Just barely hit this thing. It's on a warm too. A little different action. Maybe they want the warm today. I don't know. It looks like a floppy. Get them back in. It's a nice one. You go on a warm again. back in. This is a nice one actually. The hybrids are longer. And back in. There's another one right below us too. That's a good hit. This one's probably a little better. Oh yeah. This is probably a nice one. Oh yeah. That's a really nice one. <laughs> Fighting good. I get boogies. They mark them, drop whatever they want on top of their heads. That's a nice one. It's a tilapia. Get a big mouth on him. <laughs> there he goes. Pumpkin seed. A little pumpkin seed. Get him back in. Get him back in quick. See, I'm marking them there. I'm marking quite a bit. But then they just disappear. That's how it is. They disappear quick. There we go. Ooh. There we go. Nice one. Nice one. That's not a bad blue, you honestly. That is a nice one. Get my guess. Oh. Pumpkin seed, a big one too, actually. You can engulf this thing. You gave up. Oh. Wow, that's a cool looking pumpkin seed. Blue you are cool looking. Well, that's a really big pumpkin seed. Holy shit. I know I initially set the hook. He's set he seemed pretty big. That's a big blue gill. Let me get him back in. I wish you guys seen it. This is a nice one. Yep, nice hybrid. There we go. Look like they're hitting a little bit of everything. Crappie jigs, worms. This is one of those days. Oh, yeah. this, this one seems pretty. Oh yeah, that's a true blue yo, my favorite. Whoa, there we go. Nice, nice. Ooh, I got them in the eye too. That's why I think it wasn't really fighting. These are my favorite blue yo. They fight the hardest, I think. Really nice fish, really nice fish. Species, perch. They don't get perch. If I'm keeping fish today, it'd be a good day to keep some fish. That is a really n nice perch. Try that thing. Oh. This one's fighting good. I love fighting them on light rods, light action rods. Nice, nice. Still almost sand size. This is a nice one. This is the one I must I must have marked him. He was like four foot when I was dropping my bait down. He was dropping as soon as my, my, my bait was dropping down. Oh yeah. Ooh, true blue eel. I love these guys. They have a weird mouth. That's a big one. Kind of like a tilapia. Oh yeah. That's a big one. Not right there now, but you'll mark them, you drop it on top of their head. They'll hit it. Dude, this is a bass. Wow, that thing felt huge. He just gave up. Ooh, wow. That's a nice pumpkin seed, though. And <laughs> there he goes. Hybrid. Hybrid. Blue, not blue, yo. There we go. These guys fight better than the pumpkin seeds. Ooh. Really nice. The, into the hybrids are a little bit more narrow. The true blue wheels are wider. Get this guy unhooked. Really nice. Really nice. See on this guy. Another pumpkin seed. Pumpkin seeds feel huge. 
<laughs> what the hell, man? They feel like they're 100 pounds. Nice fish, but damn, he felt big. I hit it really good. This must be a big one, nice boy. Oh, yeah. He is fighting good. Wow, he fought a lot bigger than he was. That bad one, nice one. True blue wheel. Yahoo! That little smaller one. He's still a nice blue wheel, though. You let him, you let him grow two years, he'll be about ten inches. Yeah, nice blue wheel. Is that blue wheel? Man, these pumpkin seeds feel huge. I always think they're a bass. They're pretty looking fish, though. Big ones get pretty looking. Look at that thing. Big ass pumpkin seeds. Again, back in. Pumpkin seed, guys. Really good today. Storm's coming soon. That's why they're hitting. Barely hooked. Will we get them? Yes, we will. Man, these are nice pumpkin seeds. Pumpkin seeds I generally don't want to keep because they have a big head. Barely hooked, but it was hooked good. They are pretty, though. The big ones are really pretty. I mean, that's a big pumpkin seed. Really big pumpkin seed. Get them back in. No, oh, I dropped this thing down. Oh, another pumpkin seed. I'm not getting too many true bluegills. I'm just getting mostly pumpkin seed and hybrids. They fight good. Pretty fish. I love these pumpkin seeds. Bigger ones I like. Small ones are kind of a pain. That big head on and a big hump head. That's a nice bluegill, guys. Good one. Get back in. This guy put a little bit. Whoa! There we go, that's our true bluegill right there. My big black gill flaps. These are my favorite bluegills. These hook good. This thing, usually they fight the hardest too. You know, as you've seen, that's a nice one. You're not giving up. That's a big one there. That's a really nice one. Get him back in, but it's a beautiful fish. I love these fish. Ooh, this guy's not really fighting. Oh, well, now he is. Oh, yeah. Oh, true bluegill. Beautiful fish. Going to get back in. Nice. Oh, big ass pumpkin seed. Look at that, guys. They're a big pumpkin seed. They want the warms today. Thought that was a bass. It's a really big bluegill. Like, really big. Holy shit! I can see the size of this thing. Oh my god! This thing is huge! It's a slammer bluegill. Holy. I mean, look at that. Look at my hand. That's a giant. Giant bluegill. I'm gonna get him unhooked. Beautiful fish. That is right a Morgan. That is a big son of a bitch. Hand size blue yo. Nice. Something decent. He thumped this thing. Wow, that thing. Initially, guys, I thought this fish was a nice bass or something. See, they're using these white rods are so fun. I almost freaking broke my line. Wow, he just gave up. He did a little bit in the beginning, and that was it. Might be one of the last fish of the day. Starting to slow down. But overall, today was a great day of bluegill fishing. You can't, sometimes catching bluegill is one of the funnest things to do, honestly. That size fish, I literally thought that was a big fish. Getting back in, nice. Well, maybe one of the last fish of the day, but good fish. Oh yeah, that's a really nice bluegill. He wasn't really fighting. It's weird, because they fight, then they don't. Bluegills are probably one of my favorite fish to catch. Go back to your roots. Always go back to your roots. And bluegill. Look at that. Beautiful fish. They're my favorite ones to catch. Man, that's a pretty fish. Look at that. That's a big one, too. Really big one. Get one hooked and release. Beautiful fish. Oh. <laughs> I'm cutting that water like a tuna. Yeah, these guys fighting good. Oh yeah, nice hybrid. There we go. Yep. Nice one. My last warm here. Get 
him back in. Nice. All right, guys, back home now. It was a great day of bluegill fish. I mean, it was great catching those nice bluegills, light action rod. You can't beat that. But this day was was fantastic. It was a great day of fishing. Some really nice bluegill. A lot of them. I just I was very. It was very good. I did not think it was gonna be that good, but fish finders are one of the most important things when it comes to this fishing marking fish dropping the bait right in front of their face and another thing is finding out what they want like that crappie jig the one day a little bit today i used the warm switch to warms they they freaking they love that one bluegills love warms but there are some days well where live bait like shiners and uh crappie jigs do work better than worms but anyways great day of fishing guys that's how i really get the bluegill hope you guys learn something catch a big bluegill i said bluegill some kind of, bluegill fishing could be a little bit more complicated it really could be bluegills are some they could be tricky they really could be tricky but anyways guys great day of fishing hope you guys enjoy this video and see you guys in the next one later guys